Hey guys, it's Carrie, and I'm coming to you again with a what's in my diaper bag video. This is the Lily Jade Megan bag. It's one of their newer bags. I previously posted an unboxing video of this bag. Lily Jade was so nice enough to send me this bag. And I just want to do a quick review of what I have packed in here. So here in the front, I just to start off, this bag can be carried three ways. Um, it could be carried over the shoulders with these um, handles, which is the way that I actually carry it. You can attach this um, separately. It brings a separate messenger bag, or you can actually wear it as a backpack, and you can clip it on here and here, and there's a way to anchor it as well. I personally like this bag since it kind of looks like a purse to kind of throw this over my shoulder, and it's got a really nice drop length where it fits comfortably under your arm. So let's get started. Here in the front, you have the Lily Jade logo um, kind of on gold hardware which I love their gold because their gold is not like a harsh um, tacky gold. It's very soft and very nice. And it has a little tassel with the jade beads and the little logo as well. So here in the front pocket, I have some mommy wallet um, necessities. This is my Kate Spade little, I think it's a card holder, but I use it for coupons. This is a wallet. I love this little wallet. Then I have a little Kipling coin purse with just quarters. And then I just got this. It's also a card holder, but I love it for, um, I have it for gift cards and business cards. And it's really slim and nice and very comfortable to get things in and out. So that's everything I have in here. And as you can tell, it has a red lining, which is the same color as the inside. So here on the side pocket, I just have a pack of travel Kleenex. And then on the other side pocket, I normally keep a small set piece from the Jujube line, but I'm actually waiting for a new one that's on its way. So in here, I just have a foldable brush for me with some scrunchies and some uh, baby lips. I will probably throw in here some mascara and lipstick because it's actually New Year's Eve and um, we're going to a party later on. So happy new year, happy 2016 to everyone. So I am going to go ahead and open this up which is super, by the way, with one hand, it's super easy to open. Closing, obviously you need two hands because of the extra little thing here, but let me kind of show you guys how I have this packed and I am gonna take away, um, I'm gonna take out the insert and show you guys how I have it packed before I do. The one and only thing I do not have in an insert is a pack of Pamper Sensitive Wipes. This is just sitting up here on the top. As you can see, everything fits super nicely organized. And the only other thing I don't have in the insert, I just have it here on the side, kind of pushing the insert is a Kipling pouch. And this is a first aid kit. I just have some organic healing balm, some Tylenol syringe, an EpiPen on the bottom, some Benadryl and Tylenol, a little pill case for me, Neosporin, alcohol swabs, nothing out of the ordinary for first aid. So I think that's everything that I have on the outside. There are two pockets here and a zippered pocket. I'm gonna pull this out and then I'll go back to it. Um, it's very easy to pull out. Obviously, I'm actually sitting on the floor and this is elevated to me, so it's a little bit harder right now. Let me just pull this out of the frame. This is the insert, which I'm gonna show you guys what I have in here in a bit. But I just wanna show you guys what I have in this pocket here I just have a pack of boogie wipes and then here I just have three or four dapple pacifier wipes here in the back I just have um, some hand sanitizing wipes and some uh, one of those table toppers for the baby so I'm gonna move the bag out of the frame for a second and I'm gonna kind of go over what I have in the insert and let's put the insert actually back on here so this is a large insert they actually have sold separately inserts this is a large side they also have a medium size which comes in some of their bags their elizabeth bag has a different insert which is very close to this size but it doesn't have this extra pockets on the side and this i i feel like the pockets are a little bit snugger than this one so let's get started i'm going to start here on the side because here on the side i have nothing the reason for that is because i had the first aid kit here Normally, I keep my first aid items in a medium set piece, but as I mentioned, I do have a set on the way, so I haven't used it. And that Kipling pouch is a little too wide. It does fit, but it's kind of snug to get in and out. So I rather, for the time being, have it here and not have anything in this pocket to kind of bulk out. So here in the front, in this front, there's four pockets here in the front. 
I just have three disposable of these little Elmo changing pads. And then right behind it, I have um, two play packs. One for my son, who's six years old, almost six years old. And one for my daughter, who's three years old. And that's everything I have here. Um, I've mentioned in some of my other videos, but I thought I should mention in this one as well. I have three kids. So this is packed up basically for all three of them because the older two don't really have much. And we're only going out for a few hours for the New Year's Eve party. So here in the front, I have Cottonelle wipes for my three-year-old who's in a very long process to potty train. But I have this here. And then I have these little summer infant um, potty covers, which I love. We're going to someone's house, a cousin, so I really won't need these, but I always have them here just in case. And then here I have some Purell um, sanitizing wipes for those crazy um, change pad things. So here on the side, in this front one, all I have thrown in here is some disposable trash baggies so that it's easy access to pull one out. And right behind it, I have one of these um, changes of clothes. I love using these entire outfits for the diaper bag so I don't have to bulk up pants and shirt. And then right under it, I just have a pair of socks for the baby. I do keep a car bag as well in the car, so that's where I keep an extra change of clothes for my older two. Normally, we don't need it, but that's where I keep it just in case. Right here in the back, I have a Munchkin um, sippy cup. And then right next to it, this is kind of one feeding for the baby. I have a bib, I have a spoon, I have two of these organic Gerber pouches, and then I have some little yum plums. She likes this flavor, not the green one so much. So I think that's everything I have in here, yes. So on to the middle part. In the middle part, there's two bottle pockets, this little pocket here, zipper, a main pocket, and these two big ones. I use this one on this side. I have two size four um, Huggies diapers and then one of these good night diapers for my daughter. Again, she is potty training. She does very good with the pee pee and the potty. The poop, not so much. So when we go out for right now, I'm keeping a spare diaper just in case. And then right next to it standing is the Honest Company diaper rash cream. In this other pocket right here, I use it for toys and a, a little wubba nub bit, um, pacifier, sorry. A little teether, one of these little toy leashes, um, a rattle, and I know I started talking about my kids, but I know I mentioned six year old, three year old, and the baby's gonna be 10 months old. Here in this bottle pocket, I just have hand sanitizing spray. And then normally when we go out, I don't keep formula, but because it's New Year's Eve and it's a late party and that's the only time she has milk, either in the morning or in the afternoon, I have a Dr. Brown's already pre-filled with eight ounces of water in there for her. So the toys are in there. And then this little pocket just has a brush, comb, kind of like the one I have for me, some baby cologne for the baby or for my daughter if I need it. And then right here sitting in the middle, this is an Inno Baby Pack and Smart. It has eight ounces, I'm sorry, not eight ounces. It has formula for the eight ounces of water. It has some plum, uh, sweet potato and mango little stars, and it has some organic yogurt milks. So she's starting finally to have these and really enjoys them. And then last but not least, this is the zippered pocket. All I have in here is a um, bumpkin's wet bag. And I'm very happy we're ending because my three-year-old is asking for me. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and please subscribe to my channel if you want to watch more videos like this one. Thanks guys. Happy New Year. Bye-bye.